So this is a, let's talk a little about uh, from the investor angle, right? Everyone wants to prevent mold. What are the key conditions like needed for mold to grow? Like what, what are some, some things that cause it that we can proactively look to, to shut down before we have to call someone like yourself? Yeah, absolutely. So um, God, there's, there's, you know, we've done thousands of mold jobs over the years, but it's, it's, it's often the same few scenarios, you know, um, um, I was listening to your podcast from, uh, I don't know, a few podcasts ago, you talked about the backflow, um, th- those, those backflow valves to like prevent, um, to help prevent basements getting flooded. I thought that, I think that's, um, you know, tremendous when it comes to mold. We, a lot of our work is flooded basements. I mean, in Chicago area, um, these basements flood all the time. And, um, you know, you've got six inches of water in your basement and, um, you know, it, that's pretty much going to be a scenario. We're going to, you're going to have to do a flood cut and rip out half that basement. It's very difficult to, to clean that without doing a lot of demo there. So, um, you know, anything you can do to, to, to prevent flooded basements, um, I highly recommend, you know, also like sump pumps, making sure your sump pumps are working and even a battery um, backup, you know, make sure that sump pump doesn't go out when uh, in the middle of a storm, when you need it most, you know, I think it's worth the battery backup system. Um, and then just, I would say is preventative maintenance, you know, like caulking people don't think about doors and windows, but you know, that's how the water gets in. And you probably need to do that every five years or so. Cause uh, that, that caulk goes bad. Um, I don't know, uh, pipe leaks, you know, making sure those connections are, are good and making sure you're, you're using kind of the heavy duty, uh, um, plumbing connections and stuff. Like I remember we used a lot of the little PVC and I, cause it was cheaper. And, uh, I don't know. I, I think, I think it's worth going with the heavier duty stuff because it'll prevent water damage down the line, you know, and mold, water damage and mold. 